everybody. I hope you guys enjoy this video. These are the dolls of Toy Fair 2020. Woo, windy hair. Hello, everybody. It's Toy Fair 2020. And guess who I have with us? Hello. We got Philip. So he's going to be the cameraman to this weekend with us for the four days of Toy Fair extravaganza. So I hope you guys are excited. We have about 25 to 30 different stops. And I'm excited. Yay, new things. New things. Ooh, loud. Um, you know, we have updates to our styling heads as well as our 28 inch dolls. Um, you know, we have new glitter hair uh, feature for the style head and all new fashions for the 28 inch. We have new um, feature plush. So we have a walking puppy, which basically what you connect with the leash and you can kind of pull back on the leash and, um, and have her stop on command. You also can accessorize her and dress her up in a uniform theme. Um, you know, we have a dancing piggy as well. Um, and then, you know, some of the other new stuff and some of the stuff that's been doing really great for us are all right, you guys, so next four hair, amazing. They have the prom series, and the, this actually opens up to a dance floor, so you have a lot more play with it, and I like that they're not being wasteful with the packaging. We don't like wasteful packaging. She's still my favorite, and I promise you guys, I'm gonna review them soon. I've just been trying to find Harmony, and I can't find her in any of the Walmarts by me, so we'll see. I'll talk to them and see if we can get that happening. Um, we have the larger ones. We have a case also, which the case is so cute. I love this so much. And then now they picked up more licensing. So they have Hello Kitty, Minions, Trolls, and of course Jojo that we've seen before. And then look at the dude line. <laughs> I don't have any of the dude ones. I need to get some. And then they have more of the hair art series and one that's up here. Toy Caboodle's already looking at her. The longest hair ever. Look how cute that one is. Oh, hair goals, 100%. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we obviously started with um, oh, a yeah. collaboration yeah. with the JoJo Siwa, yeah. and then we we're, we're staggering out the release of uh, Hello Kitty, yeah. Trolls, and Minions. Obviously, all great properties that yeah. we're happy to partner with. I love it. Oh, I like that you have a case. I know. I noticed yeah. the case too. It's so cute. You know, I. Can't stuff from Spin Master in the Hatchimals line and this is going to be the Cosmic Candy series. So this one actually is a house that spins upside down so you can have a place for both your play sets. How cool is that? A spinning playhouse and then obviously more Hatchimals and for once no more waste you guys. You can actually open the egg and then save the egg. How cool is that? I'm all about like trying not to waste that much plastic so I think that's so cool. They're going with a candy theme so they are all squishy looking and then they also come with more dolls look at these cute little pixies and some have like fuzzy hair some have glitter a little bit of everything and I like that they're changing up the colors the themes on these I definitely like this more than the first series in my opinion but I want to know what you guys think about all this new stuff by Spin Master Each of them has their own unique look and style. We have a pink version and a purple version. They're USB charged, so no batteries required. And this is gonna be available in fall for $29.99 US. Oh, that one is yeah. My hand to guide her, the higher my hand goes, the higher 
That is so neat. I need one of those. Oh my gosh. The more elaborate of a hair dance you can do with your pixie. So a lot of new stuff from Twisty Pets. And as you can see here, we have Twisty Girls, which is really interesting. I do like their face a lot. And look, they separate like a normal Twisty Pet, but just into a girl form. And they have new series from treats to beauty to everything. Like a lot of new stuff from Twisty Pets. This is Summer Peaches. I love her, her hair. Popsicle. And then this is Rainbow Kate. Um, and they have new accessories the scooter and um, this little like, lunchbox. Like a little dock. Oh, it's a lunchbox? Oh, it's cute. Aww. I love all the new characters though. Yeah. And then we have some that. like Dress Up Here's Marshmallow and she's dressing up. I love her. Like that one, I love the coloring and the curls in the hair. It's so pretty. You know, we are in Rainbow Candy and um, the supermarket. So the new thing we're going to the hospital. You know, kids also go to the doctor. Yeah. <laughs> Is the hospital. We've got the baby pops coming out because we've already opened some of the regular bloom dolls on the channel so they do gender reveals so here's our little baby we're gonna go in the cold water and oh my look how fast that is that's really fast so we got a pink one oh but the baby's upset that's so cute they come with a whole little playset so this actually will turn into a whole scene playset for your blue pop doll what is inside a baby or okay. accessories okay here I know, me too. I like the yeah. sound. That's awesome. And so it's and silly, when you open it, you'll like, reveal the baby. Oh, oh the I just want to keep going. There's I like the little sleepy people. Oh, either they're so cute. <laughs> and also, the swaddles are really cool. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, know, it's yeah, like a yeah. silicone material. Uh, yeah. Oh, that's cool. Like a cell phone case. <laughs> <laughs> That's so One, cute! Yeah. And then you can switch out the different like little blankets or the swaddles yeah, on the different you dolls. Can, you can take a different swaddle and just put it on. That is so cute. Just like that. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. <laughs> Even squishier and it's like so fun to squish. And also their hair changes color in the sunlight. Really? Yeah, it's interesting. It Instead of water change, it's sunlight? Yeah, change. sunlight. So it doesn't have to be a direct sun. It, it's just UV technology. So you okay. can also do it in a home, like through window light. It works. All right, you guys. So series two for Bloom Dolls. I know if you guys want to reference back to my first video where I did it with Cassie. So you just take your little water and put it on top. And ooh, it's squirted everywhere. Oh, that is so much faster than the first series. I like that. And then look what's going come out. I like the pink and the purple swirl. Oh, who do we get? Who do we get? Is she still coming out? <laughs> we squirt some more water on her. Oh, <laughs> as I ruin their whole entire display. Oh, oh, that's cool. I like it. She's got kind of like a punk rock look to her. That's so cute. And I like that they come with a little swimsuit outfit underneath and it looks like a little chair. Yeah, and you can also open the the pot and it becomes a place set. And there are more surprises inside. And then you open it up and we love things that aren't wasteful. So this is actually a play set as well. So you hey, so we got her outfit on her and the one that we got with the little pet. I love the pet is Davis Graham as I kill him. I'm sorry. All right, he's back. <laughs> the one we got is going to be Graham. And then for her, we got Ashley. 12 adorable pets. They come in a pot like this you also get a, a charm bracelet. So you water the flower, then it opens, you'll reveal your charm bracelet, and then when you open this part, you will reveal your uh, your pet. Ooh. And they come like with this uh, with this cloud. You put water here and then you squish the cloud and there will be water dropping. Oh, from the that's cloud. so cute. <laughs> You're bringing the weather inside your home with these basically. 
So Jack still has all of their princess Tabu dolls. Her eyes look more glittery than normal. I don't know if that's me, but here's another one. They've got more of the smaller toddler dolls as well. Stuff that we've seen before, but just more play sets and stuff. they're expanding outside of just dolls and like uh -huh. I, I buy the fashions that's what I yeah. really buy a lot of that's so. what so what did you say it was doll circle right yeah yeah and we've got some of those here as well and then we've got those from the oh, cool. and it goes back and forth and you do it yeah, all with the wand turn around, like. oh <laughs> sitting that's cool though. I like that it's able to turn and everything. Yeah, along. yeah, it's awesome. It's like such a cool one, and the price is sixteen ninety nine, so it's such a good retail price as well. Um, but yeah, we're doing like big care designs, and then we're doing like unicorns and things like that as well. Like again, focusing on having like lots of sparkle in the hair. I mean, it goes with the name. So. Uh -huh, of course, <laughs> so everything out. sparkle. Yeah, that's the thing. And then we've got yeah. So these we have with Walmart, and then these little ones. And then we're starting to do a bit more online. So we'll have like the horse and carriage and the camper van as well. I like the bigger packaging on them now yeah, too, and I like straight like the characters. This one's so cute. And we've put like illustrations so that you can kind of kind of feels a little bit more like. Yeah, you connect with the doll a little bit better, and uh -huh. I love this gardening set. I think I saw yeah, Froggy cool review yeah. it. Yeah, I think Fro yeah, Froggy did, did one of those. That was yeah, cute. Was really oh, so thank good. you. Gotta have my Valentine's Day nails on, you guys. <laughs> oh, I like her. She's cute. And then mermaids. We love mermaids, of course. And then, oh, ooh, a sparkle case. Yeah, so oh, it's like a wardrobe awesome. inside, and you can like keep your doll and all the fashions in there. Oh, I love that. kind of the reverse of what happens to yeah. my hair. Yeah. Um, so the, the harder you pull, the tighter the curl. Ooh. And the best part That's of all is if you take the already curled hair, this is a good amount, and you dip it in warm water, it magically straightens. Whoa. So you can do it again. That's cool. That's it's really, really neat. Magical. And if any of you want to get a uh, a great shot of the doll itself. Yeah. We can curl one of their hair completely. Do you guys want to try it? Yeah. Someone want to try it? I'm going to film you doing it. Okay. Yeah, that's what I'm doing too. I'm like, I'm filming I'm you. a professional. Yeah, you know how to do it. You can this. do it with two or three yeah. at the same time as well. And again, if you wanted to get a specific style, yeah. you just could, certain you could spend more yeah. time yeah. getting the curl just so. For now, just to show you yeah. guys how it And it works. comes with like beads and accessories. Yeah, and beads stuff. and accessories oh, that you can pull on. I like their faces. They're really super cute. And they all have different personalities and interests. And it's all about unlocking your curl power. Uh huh. So, of course, we had to add an empowering message. And now for a dip. Oh my god, that looks so cool. I love it. <laughs> and it's straight again. Oh, that's so oh, wow. cool. I love that. Uh, I like this one the best because I like her little pigtails and it comes with a little pet. That's so cute. I'm really feeling like, I don't know, again, the coloring is cute. I like the style. They come in different play sets. Uh, she's adorable also, but this one's my favorite though. What do you guys think? Let me know. <laughs> Okay, so we're at Jay at Play's booth, and we have a lot of new stuff from like baby buffies, buffies, I can't even pronounce it, to baby jemmy dragons, which I uh, love this egg. Look at that. That looks really cool. And then, what's this plant stuff? Bloomy belly bells? Oh, these are kind of cute. I like their faces. I like her. I like that one. Oh, here they are, super cuties. Hmm, so they got like superhero baby dolls, interesting. So they're really expanding outside of like the boxy girl stuff. And then we also have the bellies here. Look at that face. 
Hmm. They, like the hair is interesting on this one. And then of course, what we really want to see from this area is boxy girls. Now they've expanded outside of just having like play, set, play sets and then the surprise dolls. And now they're going into bigger things. I like the boxes. I like that they're changing it up a little bit with the style. Uh, going into here, we have like accessories for them too. Interesting. And now this is where it's really weird. They're coming out with the rainbows line and the dolls are in different colors. Kind of reminds me a little bit of like alien looking dolls. Ooh, I like this one. That one's really cute. I don't know. Comment, let me know what you guys are feeling with these rainbow ones. I know a lot of people have been posting about them in the past day or two since they got released. And then here are more single release dolls with like different makeup and they're called Hello Pretty Dream Play. So a lot of different stuff. Two girls in one. Uh, I love these bags. Do these bags come with something? Oh, I want these bags. Oh, these bags are so cute. Um, I hope that comes with the doll and not just here for display because those bags are adorable. Um, was me when I had pink hair. <laughs> Love that. And then what do we have over here? Some more of the single release dolls. Oh, these are cute. Okay. I actually really like the boxy babies. Look at this one. These are adorable. Okay. I love... I love these. I love the size on them. These, they, I wasn't sold on them completely, but I love those. And I guess they come like this in the minis packaging. Hmm. I don't think any of this stuff is out yet, so we have to still look at it. Oh, and then look, there's slots everywhere. Press here. Does he actually work? Oh, and that's probably prototype. Lola Brights. Um, all I know is that I love this one and I need it. Um, Crybabies dolls that are launching in fall. This is Lizzie. She's adorable. She's a little peacock. And we also have Daisy, who is an adorable little kitty. And of course, they cry just like a classic crybaby. These little cute, adorable tears there. These are loved by like everybody. We had Chrissy Teigen's daughter Luna carrying around her crystal doll like all over the place. Like yes. kids love these little guys. Yeah, they do. And because they love them so much, IMC Toys has actually um, created the softest crybaby um, yet. This new product, which is out in the fall. This is called Coney, um, Goodnight Coney. It's the softest crybaby doll, and her head is a little softer too. So because kids are taking this little cutie everywhere, um, this doll will actually help transition playtime to nap time and bedtime. So I'll come show you how that works over here. Oh, I love the reindeer. <laughs> so this is just a little demo set here so you guys can see. And of course, um, nap time, bedtime is always like tricky for every parent, every kid. What you can see here is a glowing nightlight effect. If you can see. That's cute. I and like there's that. no water involved here. Instead of water, LED tears. Oh. Blue LED tears. Oh. So, we're not so you take this bink you take her binky out and her pacifier out, and you can see. Oh, yeah. You guys oh, might wow. want to get closer. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. I know. He's adorable. Oh, wow. That's cute. Really, really cute. Then when you put her pacifier back in, doesn't stop there, there's actually soothing lullabies. Five different lullabies that play, and it over a ten over ten minutes. And after ten minutes, the lights and the um the lights in the lullaby will stop. So it's not like it's gonna be going all night where you have to wake up at 3 a.m. and then turn the doll off. It will shut off. That's so cool. this is happening, this is launching in fall, and it will be just like, I think every parent's kind of dream, and kids will just yes. love this product. Love yeah. That. We're so excited about this one. A very popular Crybaby Magic Tears that was in the advent calendar that oh, we launched yes. on Amazon. Oh, okay. It was really adorable, and now yeah, she's, she's back her own big girl doll. with a big girl doll. Oh, I love, oh, I love you, Ruth familiar with the Crybaby Magic Tears of Surprise and Delight. So um, this is actually Bottle House Wave 3. You can tell by the different colors okay. um, and each wave the Bottle Houses are different. Still Surprise and Delight element and all different characters. There will be 12 with one rare and of course they cry magic tears and have the accessories that are matching their personality and each character. So that'll be out shortly. It's very, very cute. Um, and then we also have expansions oh of the Crybaby line. I love the keychains. This is, this is launching in um, April, um, 2021. And instead of being in their magical 
Crybaby Magic Tears Coral little forest thing, they're going to be in a smoothie shop. So that's why their surprise capsules are like this little house that's like a smoothie shop. So cute. What's unique about these is they don't have animal onesies, they have fruit onesies and they smell. Oh, scented. Scented. These adorable scents. This is a berry, so this is going to smell like berry. So cute. Only a, a couple of these fall, and then it will spring open. Once it springs open, you'll see one of six characters, and there is one rare, adorable little one here. Aww. And they're super sparkly, and they have, as you can see, this little turnstile, and this, you'll pop this cardboard out, and that's where you'll reveal the accessories. Oh, okay. The accessories will just pop out of there. Oh, that's cool. So even extra surprise yeah, and delight but there. not damaging the background. Not damaging yeah. the background, because you have to, the other ones you kind of have to yeah, pull yeah. through. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I like um, that So idea. that'll be really cute. And instead of the blanket that the other ones have, yeah. they have a little pillow plushie Aww. that's really that's unique so and, and cute. What? Yeah, this is what I was like waiting and for. And super cute about this. These are so cute. Is of course, <gasps> they oh. come like this. Oh my. When you submerge them into water for 20 to 30 seconds, they spring open. Oh. And when they spring open, let's see if I have some what, one ready. When they spring open, you'll find your mermaid inside. Mm -hmm. Adorable. There are 12 characters plus one rare and one ultra rare. Mm -hmm. The rares have very pearlescent, adorable um, little finishes on them. Yeah. They're super cute. You yeah. open this, and there is a little map for you Aww. to look at, what, and a little pearl belt. Mm -hmm. To unlock your pearl, you move this little guy around and kind of jiggle it out like a like a marble maze, kind of. Oh, okay. And then. We have to work for it. You have to work for it. It unlocks your pearl oh, that your character wow. then wears on her little belt there. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> Super cute. What I love these. Oh, I like the Plus, the packaging does an undare, and it's a little purse after. So Snap Stars has a bunch of new things coming out from new fashions, new wigs, which hello, I love that wig, um, love the flamingo, that is super cute, and she's a DJ booth, and it actually um, is a Bluetooth speaker, alright, I need that one, that is so cute, and I love the little heart fashion, oh my god, heart fashion with the little like speaker would be so cute and then they have more accessories too uh all right all right the one with that wig we've had wig issues before but that little like space bun one is so cute and i love the little fashions for sure all right you guys so for 2020 mattel one of the new lines they're going to be releasing is cave club so with these there's going to be it looks like six different characters and of course a t-rex to go with it I'm really excited just because I like their hair colors. I like that they're kind of stuffy and short. Like, personally, that looks really cute, and I love the T-Rex. It gives me a little bit of 80s vibes. Almost, I don't want to say He-Man, but this idea of, like, short, big feet, kind of, like, broad looking. Now, it looks like a mixture between Monster High face molds and a combination of, like, uh, Enchantimals style height, but still giving me a little bit of something new. Um, they do have some articulation. It looks like it has very similar, almost like Monster High hand molds. If you look at this one, this reminds me a little bit of Draculaura. So it does have, like, molds that we've seen before from Mattel, so it looks like they're reusing a little bit of that. I do like, like I said, the hair colors are really, really, really cute. I don't have names on the dolls, but when I do, I will definitely try posting those on Instagram. So if you guys are not following me on social media, definitely go check me out on Instagram, Facebook, all that good stuff. And I will be adding still images on Instagram of these as well. So like I said, these are called Cave Club. I'm going to not be able to say that right. I'm going to get tongue twisted. Looks like they also have a book too. So it looks like they also have a book as well. So this is a prototype looking, but it's still really cute though. So like I said, I hope you guys comment below and let me know what you guys think of Cave Club.
more dolls for the Wonder Woman series. So it's WW84. So is that how you say it? I feel like I'm saying that incorrectly. Wonder Woman 84. Um, so there's different dolls. I personally like this one the best just because, uh, hello, anything leopard print. She also has a snake skin print jacket and really high boots. So this is her casual outfit, but I personally really like her. We also have her in her gold form, if you want to call it that, and then her in her standard outfit. Um, there is three in this series, and yeah, like I said, I'm interested to see what you guys have to say about the new Wonder Woman dolls. to you guys and they're pre-order now but they're going to be available in the fall so let me know what you guys think about zombie 2 dolls there's going to be six in the series as you can see here and like i said i'm going to have more pictures on instagram available for you guys if you guys want to zoom into those Creatable World came out last year in 2019, and now they're just expanding with more. Now they do have um, this cute panda onesie, which I really, really, really like. Um, definitely gonna have to get that outfit. So for not even them, but just I think they fit also like skipper dolls, so I might have to get it for a skipper doll. But like I said, they're coming out with a lot more from the series. There's also going to be a closet, which I'll take some footage of that for you guys too. But yeah, what do you guys think? I mean, are you excited about more Creatable World stuff? And of course, we're in the Barbie section. So now we have Barbie Princess Adventure. And as we zoom in, we can see her in her different outfits. They also come with separate outfit packs too. We've got a prince. We've got, oh, look at the little bed. I love the bed and the two little puppies it comes with. Really, really cute. Um, I think every princess needs a little pig in her life. That is very much me. It is awesome. I agree with that. And then look at these. I like the fashion packs. I think those are winning me a little bit more in this series. And like I said, this is called Princess Adventure. So Barbie's Dream House now has changed up as they do every year. And this year she has Aw, a wheelchair accessible elevator. I think that is absolutely awesome. I glad, I'm glad that they're always changing, expanding what we see with the dollhouse. Now they do have the extra pool on the second floor, big slide coming around, and then the three tier that we've seen in prior dollhouses. But like I said, that extra elevator room, super cool. We've got a new camper. So camper separates into like a little truck as you can see here. And then we have all of our little pieces, the shower, um, even a boat. Oh, I like that. I like how it says Barbie on the side. That's cute. <laughs> Picnic table, a little swimming pool in the back there. Kitchen area, as you can see, and then just a flat display with, oh, a bunk bed and a regular bed in there. So Barbie's got more careers. She's over 200 now. I mean, what a girl. I, I, I don't know if I could handle it. That's a lot. <laughs> but we have the little like ramen sushi type of thing going on here. I have seen this in the store. It's cute. I like the shirt. I like the little pieces. Um, I'm not too much of a Play-Doh fan when it comes to the Barbie line, but it is a really cute idea and I like that. And then here's some more of the careers in the back. So we have a boxer, chef, uh, veterinarian, which we've seen before, pop rock star, pop star, I guess, astronaut. Every year, Barbie's in the Olympics, and this year is Tokyo 2020. So they come with different outfits, and her and her different, oh, I love that. I love the karate one. And these look like they have not a full made-to-move body, but they have an articulated body. So I like that they're giving some articulation in this at least, just because she is obviously in sports and you would want her to be somewhat articulated if she's playing sports. <laughs> so we've got, like I said, a karate, we have baseball, we have surfing, that's really cool. And then we have a little display area here too with all of the other Barbies. Uh, every girl, you know, she's got 200 careers, so now she's a little tired. So now we've got some of the relaxation dolls, which we've seen these out already. Uh, super cute, chest lights up. She does breathing exercises with you. And then look, oh, she's got plants. Barbie's got her little succulent on her shelf. Oh, my dream, I love it. And then she's got a little foot spa. In the back here, we see that she has a yoga mat one, which I need to get, that one with the yoga and the girl power shirt totally me love the pajamas on that one and then look she has a whole like play-doh spa area oh that is so cute barbie needs to relax it's come on a long time she's been around a while 
We are Barbie, so more from the Fashionista line. We have fashion packs here in the back row, if you can see the back row right there. And then more from the Fashionista series. I love that they're doing more when it comes to clothes, outfits, more body styles. Um, hello? When? Why is there not been already a ball Barbie? I love that. That is so cool. Oh, the red, orange hair to this one. Like, doing so much, and I absolutely am so excited about it. More from the Barbie inspiring women's line. We have Billie Jean King, uh, Ella Fitzgerald, and then Florence Nightingale. And I like that they're doing stuff that isn't just glamorous. I mean, like you have to think in a time when <laughs> things weren't so easy. You know, I'm glad that they're giving girls history. I mean, these women are important to not only history itself, but also to women's history as well. Like, this is just so cute. I absolutely love it. I love how that she has uh, made a made-to-move body on here, which of course her being in sports. I love the stunning gown and the microphone with her and her hair is just so pretty. And then this one, I love the detail with the face molding. They did a really great job. Who else would you guys want to see in the inspiring women's line? holiday giftable okay. item. Yeah, 35 plus surprises and, and uh, reveals oh, wow. in and one it, package. So it's one doll with a bunch of accessories with it or is um, it multiple? So it'll be one Barbie, okay. one Chelsea, a few pets, and then everything oh, okay. that you need for a slumber party themed play. Oh wow, that's so cute. And then obviously you're doing more with the Color Reveal series in general yeah, for spring? Yeah, so we or? launched it in the fall of last year. Mm -hmm. In spring of this year, you'll see the two colors going to change. Oh, there okay. will be a different theme for the dolls. Okay. We're going to add Chelsea in spring, which is Barbie's youngest sister. Yeah. Everything's very similar to Barbie, but just on a smaller scale. So mm -hmm. a ponytail instead of a wig, okay. color change on the shirt instead of the makeup. And then in fall, the dolls that you're looking at here are all outdoor themed. Um, so then there will be warm and cold water change in the wigs and the ponytails. And then we're going to introduce pets. They'll come in a little case like this. You reveal the top to look like this, and then all your fun accessories and pets will come inside. Oh, that's awesome. JoJo is everywhere, even with Cabbage Patch, now with Jazzwares. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Look, there's different faces, too. There's one with her with her teeth and then one without, which is more of the face that I'm used to with my Cabbage Patch dolls. But that is so cute, though. I like that they're partnering up. And then we've also got the Classic Series. So, of course, has the yarn hair. And then, obviously, the newer ones with the uh, curly hair and different faces. And then now even the Babylon and Sing Toddler. So she actually does do stuff with the app. So yeah, Cabbage Patch is expanding as always. girly booth and this is so cool it's actually designed by a group of girls like young women creating dolls for themselves and I think that is so cool one of the staff here is just so pleasant and sweet by the way um, showed us all of the wigs you can do interchangeable wigs they have 18 inch dolls they have 14 inch they also have clothing for all of them and accessories this is so cute and then they have giant styling heads which are massive and then you can style the wigs any way you want this is so cute 
I'm feeling these, and this booth is just fabulous. Like, look at this runway that they gave us here to show off the dolls. Like, how perfect. I absolutely think they're so cute. I do love the details on the clothing. Like, the clothings, there, none of them are going to be printed on. So we got the little sequence on here. And look at this jacket, which is really, really in right now. You always see, like, the teddy bear material. And the handbags. Look, zippers, you guys. We've got zippers on the handbags. And, like, look at this fanny pack moment. Love it. Love it. And then one good thing about the shoes, they even have, like, little studs. Like, that is so neat. Oh, my God. It's a leopard print studded sneaker. <gasps> okay, they're winning me with the accessories. She has a light up and sound feature. We put the ice accessory on her arm, and when you lift it up, three different sound patterns, as well as a fun light show. We also, in the spring, have Elsa and Anna, the musical adventures. They sing. Show yourself! And then over here, we have Rooney the Salamander, who's the fire spirit in Frozen 2. Oh. And just like Elsa, you can feed him an icy snowflake, and when you do, his color will change to cool blue. Aww. So this is from the flashback at the beginning of the film, where the girls remember their mother singing. She actually sings. And then you have designed a dress, Elsa. So instead of it being fabric, it's vinyl. And it comes with two sheets of vinyl decals. So you can put them on, take them off very easily. You can also draw on the dress with stencils or freeform. And then you just take a damp cloth to wipe it off. I'm so excited, you guys. Guess what's coming out? Mulan dolls, which are already out. I've seen, I think, this one at Target, if I'm not mistaken. But I love this one. Oh my gosh, her armor looks so cute. And I love the face mold on it. It's different than what we've seen before for Hasbro dolls. I am so excited for this movie. I know definitely Claudina is, if you're watching this video right now. <laughs> this is so cool. I'm just so glad they're doing Mulan dolls. And then we have more of the the Disney style series dolls. <gasps> Look how cute they are. Oh, I'm so excited. I hope you guys can hear me. Everybody else is playing behind me, so there's a lot of stuff going on. But they're so cute. Oh, look at the, I love her. I regret not getting her. She is so pretty. And of course I have Ariel, which I have reviewed. So if you guys want to go back in my videos and watch that. But oh, I don't know which one's my favorite. Comment, which one do you guys like out of all these? Like d three different light shows with her with the light that goes yeah, through the water, yeah. and then you have the glitter. <gasps> so the it's glitter. like a snow globe. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so you can see that's pretty. She's swimming, and she's not out yet though. She's up here in the spring. Long. Spring. Yeah. Okay. She's in the spring. I love and that one. We also have the Warrior Moves Milan, which is complimenting the film coming out next month. So you guys have had her before with yeah. like looking like this. Right. Is this one a different variation of it or just the same it's one? Just the similar. Same one. Okay. Yeah. Where you can do the chop action. Oh, in the oh, I see it. Like you pull the cardboard out, and then there's pieces inside. Yes. Got it. Got it. And then there's those roll in the kitchen for storytelling, place of lots of accessories for the kitchen. I love it. That's based off of Sugar Rush, you know, in the kitchen. Yeah. 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 So this this is the sweet treats truck. Oh my God. That when it's folded up, the ice cream sandwich picnic table is the roof. When you unfold it, you reveal the picnic table, the candy machine. The ice cream station where you get your waffle, waffle oh, look cones, how cute that is. and your scoops of ice cream. Oh, and over here you have the soda fountain where you can get your soda drinks. Oh, this is so cute. I love that. I love the van. And look, oh look, Cinderella has like a little sugar rush like scooter. This is cute. Oh, I want the table. The table is my favorite. Thank you everybody for watching my Dolls of Toy Fair 2020 video. Comment below what are some of your favorite dolls that you've seen in this video. I try to do a little bit of everything. So some of the larger dolls, surprise dolls. Unfortunately, MGA only showed older items. So no new items from MGA. But thanks for watching you guys and comment below.